Hello everyone, well Snow Leopard is here, the brand new exciting version of Apple's Mac OS X operating system and one of the things many people are talking about is its ability to protect you against some forms of malware. So right now, Snow Leopard can only protect you against two families of Mac Trojan horses, which hackers have been distributing in the wild for some time via infected websites and luring unsuspecting Mac users into infection. So what we thought would be interesting was to test how well Snow Leopard works at protecting you against those kind of attacks. So I'm running Safari now on Snow Leopard and I'm going to point the browser at a piece of Mac malware. It's downloading the malware, um, it's going to try and auto mount it because that's the setting I have on Safari and bing, there we go. It's determined that it's infected by something that it calls OS X RS Plug A. Okie dokie, let's do the same test again. Um, this time I've got antivirus software running and I'm going to point Safari at the infected DMG file. It downloads it and wham, there you go. Sophos antivirus has intercepted it. In fact, we've got in before Snow Leopard has. And that's a good thing because you want to be able to run antivirus software alongside Snow Leopard's own protection. All right, so next test, let's run the malware from a USB stick. What would happen then? So I've plugged in a USB stick. Um, let's open it up. I'm not running any antivirus software this time. And Snow Leopard is opening the USB stick. Oh, and it's uh, installed the PKG file. And uh-oh, it's actually running the Trojan horse. Um, so this could end up infecting my computer. OK. Let's do the test again, but this time with antivirus installed. So I plugged in a USB stick. I'm going to try and run that infected DMG file, and bam, there you go. Sophos has intercepted it, something which Snow Leopard couldn't do. The reason is, what Apple have done with Snow Leopard is they haven't really integrated an antivirus program. They've added something which can block some malware under some conditions. But let's not forget, the threat of Apple malware is very real. We've seen time and time again websites which have been set up with infections designed to infect Macintosh users. Sometimes they've used social engineering tricks to try and fool you into being infected. Maybe you've gone looking for sexy videos, for instance, and in fact got yourself a nasty infection instead. So Apple may not have integrated an antivirus into Snow Leopard, but they have put something in there to protect against some forms of malware under some conditions, and that's better than nothing. What we hope is that this will get stronger and stronger in the future, and that Apple will work with the rest of the security industry to make everyone's life that little bit safer.